Greetings McWarriors, hello ladies and gentlemen, this is TTB speaking and welcome back to Battletech. Now guys, we are still in Urban Warfare mode, haven't had an Urban Warfare mission yet, but let's see what kind of missions we get here. Base destruction, recovery, 3 star battle or a 3 star assassination. This could be a good mech. Let's negotiate salvage. Accept. We're not launching yet though because I still need to repair my mechs and get my pilots ready again. And uh, that just means we advance the timeline a little bit. Banshee will be done. There we go. Battlemaster will be done in a sec. And then we will have the Highlander ready for glitch. The, the lassie is going to pilot the laddie. <laughs> Meeting Archangel. What the hell? We've been gathering supplies planet side, but have spent the last hour trying to fight Yang. The sound of cheers and pounding metal draws you to the edge of town where a pair of haphazardly repaired industrial mechs beat on each other. Yang calls you over. Sorry I wandered off, boss. I heard a guy in the market bragging about this agro mech fighting club. I've had to see it for myself. One of the mechs is in notably better condition than the other one, but the second clearly has the better or possibly drunker pilot. The shinier mech finally falls and the small group of winning bettors collect from the bookie. Yang gestures to the junkier mech as the cockpit opens. You have to meet this pilot. He said any aggro mech can be made combat ready if you're not afraid of the challenge. Shall we buy the Victor a drink? Sure. <laughs> I'd like to meet him myself. Um, despite the Rex's abandon of his fighting style, he doesn't seem drunk, just exuberant. He juices himself as Archangel and gladly takes Yang up on the offer of a few drinks. When he finds out you command a mech mercenary company, he buys the next one himself and starts feeding you out for any openings in your crew. As soon as we're done here, I'm going to register with the local hiring hall. But hey, if you don't have an opening now, that's fine. I think it's time for me to leave this rock anyway. I'm sure we'll meet again. Error! Resolving curse system, get last pilot added to hiring.name on battletech.sim.gamestead. <laughs> Uh, well, a big error is now present in the local hiring hall, but well, ain't that nice. There he is, Archangel. Oh, he's actually not bad. Got multi-target, he's got bulwark, and he's got... Um, he could be a learn boat, Lord. This looks like a learn boat, Lord, to me. Hmm. Not too bad. Not too bad. Wouldn't be bad to have him on board, so let's just hire him. New Why not? <laughs> okay, um, and then... I think we already been to the store, right? Yeah, yeah, there was a griffin in here. Ah, if only I could buy double heat sinks. The world would, still be, would be so much better. If only Lost Tech wasn't so lost. <laughs> Alright. Get glitch in the Highlander ready again. Alright. Did we accept the contract? No, oh, not quite. Exactly. Okay, Heart of Darkness it is. Let's knock this out quick. And here we go. Glitch, here's your shiny new Highlander. Ah, nice drop tonnage. 360 tons. We're getting closer to my level of. Comfort here, guys. 400 tons is what I like to drop. I like to drop heavy and only drop once. But TTP, where is the sportsmanship in that? Fuck sportsmanship. This is war. <laughs> so, I mean, three skulls assassination is probably a, um, a VIP in a heavy. But, I seem to remember I fell a 3 skull assassin where it was just one atlas. Nothing else, but one atlas. But that was creepy. If we can get an atlas, this game is over. I'm going to be so happy if we ever get an atlas, but I haven't seen one yet, and I also haven't seen a king crab yet. Or a stalker. Command interface initiated. Nope, there's not gonna be a heavy mech. There's not a lot, of, a, lot of, a lot of stuff around here, let's see. There is the traitorous commanders over here, directed forces are over there. Um, well, is there any way up here? Nope. Well, they will have just to walk all over the place, so... We'll just go after the reinforcements first. Let's, let's, let's go after the reinforcements first, because... Well, because we can. Run, brave mech warriors. Enemy turn. 
Are you done training? Alrighty. And we will start sprinting again. Roger that. <laughs> Glitch is so slow now. But it doesn't matter. Whoa! Actually, that's a medium lance. Um, that's not very friendly. There's a lot of griffins. Okay. Decker, you're up. Into the forest we go. Introduce yourself to the griffin, please. Say hi with the AC-20 for me. Engaging. Ooh! <laughs> what a shot! Right arm destroyed, all the weapons gone. Reporting. Critical hit. Beautiful. Um, Jägermeck, if anybody asks. Also annoying that you can see me, but I can't see I'm you. Alright, because he can use his weapons at longer ranges, haha. <laughs> it's got ACs. I remember. That's annoying. Oh, of course. From the boonies. Lerms from the reinforcements. Annoying as ever. Okay, TTB to be able to do anything needs to sprint. And then Behemoth can go into the forest here. And maybe start working on that griffin some more. Mm -hmm. And now Glitch, yep, hang on, I said now Glitch can move up and do Glitch things like the first LRM-60 volley of the campaign. Let's fly the missiles! <laughs> Bonk, sit down! Ouch. I think the Banshee is actually the weak link right now in my team. Because Banshee definitely has the last, at least, amount of firepower. Alright, Decker, maybe move you here. Um, yeah, let's take out that Griffin because he's annoying. Uh, maybe not with as much firepower because we don't need that. That should be enough if you hit the city. Yep. Good shot. Now we're inspired. Oh, it's a quick die. Mm, I'd rather have that Jäger mech over there, though. Okay, he's coming to me. Very nice. How, how, how good of him to come to me. That's, that's just perfect. Oh, did he just hit them with a stray shot, or what was that? Interesting, that's a new mechanic. So, Lurm Volley can hit mechs next to you. <laughs> Ridiculous. Okay, TTP, you know what your job is. You just you just walk casually over here, and you go onto the Jägermeck and you say, Yo, I'm TTP, I got double AC-20s. And then you should hit the CT and everything dies, but nope, it doesn't happen. Unfortunately, the story did not go that way. Okay, uh, we just do have Glitch though. And Glitch would like to say hi to that Jägermeck. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Woo -hoo! Glitch is the Lerm Lady from Hell. Alright. Um, let's get the Banshee into the forest. Um, pull the coolant vent right away. And start firing on that quick draw. Just get some damage down here. Yeah, the city is open. We're inspired again. Some PPC fire from this guy to be annoying. Decker's Battlemaster is still holding, that's good. Okay, Decker, you go into the forest here. And you will use all your weapons onto this guy's CT and hopefully murder him outright. Well, not all your weapons, maybe just this much. Okay, that should be fine. RIP! You gotta abuse those call shots, guys. Otherwise, you have no chance in later missions because the game just throws so much tonnage against you. Um, and since they all have long-range weapons like this bullshit... Um, yeah, hello bracket builds. That only works in tabletop, it doesn't work in MechWarrior Online, let me tell you that much. <laughs> um, so, since it always throws so much stuff at you, you just have to kill these guys as fast as possible. Uh, we don't have a call shot. We do have a call shot right now, but I don't think it's necessary. I'm just gonna shoot this guy. 
<laughs> no more weapons. <laughs> Disarmed with one volley. This this Highlander 732 Bravo is so brutal. It is it is not even funny anymore. Rip. Very nice. Now the reinforcements will slowly waltz towards us. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna come like this. Which means we'll just go over here and we should find them. Um, hang on, no, no, no. We'll brace everybody. We will we will brace everybody. We'll, we'll cool down. Let them come to us. Because I don't want to be in the crossfire between that uh, guy here and his buddies. Okay. Okay. Yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll, um, we'll reserve one more turn. Let them come even closer. Come to me, little idiots. Is it just two? 50 tons. Okay. Alright, Decker. We'll move you closer. And we sensor lock the 52 tunnel. That should be a griffin. No, Kintaro. Never mind. I misspoke. Okay, we can move. Actually, Behemoth could see them from over there, but not from here. So let's move over here. And dig in. Move TTB. Can we move TTB in a spot where they can't see him? Here. Okay. And then Glitch. Well, Glitch also moves, but Glitch does something else. Oh, there's some other guy up top. Okay. Here we go. Oh, so it's a full lance, actually. Can you believe this bullshit? That's two full lances and the assassination target. And that's that's sold to you as a free skull mission. Bullshit. Game. Bullshit. I don't really want to move there. I actually want to move back here. That might be the smartest move to do. Because I don't want to fight against these guys at the same time. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to pull back here. Yes, Commander. We are definitely going to pull back here. Um, Decker, however, is not going to running. He's just going to move. Roger and that. sensor lock. Mm -hmm. Our gentleman lock. friend over here. Yeah, we're, we're definitely moving. TGB, get your ass over here. Oh, never mind. What is that? 95? Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Um, Gitchi will stay here. We will learn the Kintaro. This time he's not in cover or anything. This is gonna hurt. Very nice! Oh, that was beautiful. 95 tons. Hmm. Let's get Behemoth way back. On my way. Double time. All right. Force him to come to us. Yeah, you're running, dude. You know why you're running. 50, 65, 55, and 55. Okay, Decker. You can go here. On the move. And you will sensor lock once again this gentleman. Because I want to kill him. You're just gonna murder him next round, I think. Ah, uh, okay. Glitch, no need to move. You just stand here and you just kill this guy if you can. Probably not because he's uh, a bulwark and everything, but you can do some good damage to him. Another hit like that and you're Still, one, two, three, four targets on the field that are dangerous. Let's move TTB into the forest uh, here, and we go brace. I need to brace all my biggies. I need to brace all my fatties. In the forest because then they won't do, take any damage whatsoever. Um, this is the Kentaro still. <laughs> I need to be so careful here. Maybe move Decker here into the forest. Sensor lock the Kentaro. Got a lock. Getting ready for a glitch volley. Waiting on you, Commander. And next volley. Okay. Yep, he's down. Very nice. Well done, Glitch. Did you see that? Well done, Glitch. I'm <laughs> slowly running out of ammo. Oh, Banshee. Okay. Um, oh, it's a free M. Alright, so same thing as this thing. Alright. Well, I do want one to sell. So, maybe. 
Maybe just, just, just maybe we'll show him the dark side of the force. All right, you guys ready for this? Now you see him. Now you don't. Or not. Because TTB doesn't want to hit. Uh, he hit with the with the SRMs. Oh, come on, dude. What is your malfunction? All right. Um, we'll move the Banshee over here. Location confirmed. I mean, I could try Precision Strike, but I don't know if it's going to kill his cockpit. But we'll try it. Why not? I mean, we have two more left, so might as well try it. Uh-huh. Yes! <laughs> Woo! Do you see how that, that molten stuff came out of the cockpit? That was beautiful. Rip! <laughs> oh, so you can multi-hit this thing. Good to know. Well, uh, Decker, you know your job. Be the asshole that always sensor locks. Ooh, Centurion. And then we can move Glitch over yonder, and Glitch can say hi. Uh, or not, because he's hot. Uh, not a problem. Cool and vent. Keep firing, Glitch! So much firepower. Okay, can we get TTB in range to shoot? No. I'm just gonna sprint TTB in now. It doesn't, it doesn't even matter. These guys have no chance in close range. Same thing with Behemoth. She's just gonna sprint in and be like, yo! Just around the corner. Wolverine. How sweet. He shots he shoots one weapon. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> Centurion, there he is. And he misses. Beautiful. But stray shot actually takes away an invasive pip from TTB. That's annoying. So you don't want to cluster your mechs uh, together anymore. It's interesting. Okay. Let's get um Decker closer. Actually we can just sprint in Decker so he can start shooting next round. Thunderbolt. Oh! More stray shots! Holy hell, this is really annoying! Okay. Um, Glitch will move you over here. Um, this guy is... None of these guys are in any kind of cover whatsoever, so... Um, let's just work on the Centurion first, whatever. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> and if you think that hurt... Wait till you see this. Ripperoni, Jabroni. Bye bye. And then TTB goes ahead and says Yo, I'm TTB. I got big auto cannons. And I hit the head, but only with the SRMs again. <laughs> Run! Flee! Flee for your lives! Yeah. This is now this is now a little bit evil. But if I ha if I didn't have these big ass mechs, if I didn't have an assault lens, if I just dropped, let's say, a heavy lens or like a mixed medium and heavy lens, like you would you would get demolished by this. It's that's ridiculous. I think that's the, the intel is really bad on these mission descriptions. Okay, um, let's see if we can get another head hit in here. Nope. Are going for a back shot? No, side shot. Okay. Warning. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let me show you what low armor looks like. Warning. Armor low. He's still alive. I still I didn't hit the head. <laughs> okay, Behemoth, can you can you save our honor, Behemoth? No, you can't because you don't have any. Oh well, just fire your lasers and shut up. No, still not enough. He's still alive for some reason. This guy is annoying. This guy is really annoying. I go there. How much? Nope. Oh, okay, never mind. Let me just shoot from here. Shut down alert. Two. Hey, buddy, How much can this guy take? Ah, okay, ammo explosion, finally. Don't put ammo into your city, guys. Really bad idea. Okay, anybody want the Wolverine? Not much armor left in that location. Commander? Aye, aye. 
Decker, would you do the honors and go headhunt the Wolverine? Nope. Okay. Huh. All right. Never mind. AC20 misses, but the medium lasers fix it. Very nice. Mission successful. It's so nice I say it twice. That was a nice one. Surprise Banshee. Free skull mission. A heavy lance. A medium lance. And an assault mech. In the free skull mission. That is, that is bullshit, guys. <laughs> it's just bullshit. <laughs> Alright. Everything is hunky-dory, though. That's good. So, yeah. I'm gonna get the Banshee and sell it, I think. Let's see what else we can get here. Anything good? Learn 15 double crit? Nope. E plus 3 accuracy. Nice. Uh, any good components? Except all those 10,000 heat sinks. Nope. Nothing for the cockpit, so no mods. That's annoying. Hmm. So do I take the medium laser double plus with the accuracy bonus? Or... Do I take a mech here? I don't really need mechs right now. Um, the weapon right now. I'm gonna take the quick draw part to sell. Okay. So, we just got a quick draw and a Banshee. Not too shabby. But yeah, the Banshee... I mean, it's not a bad mech, but it's also not a really good mech because you're forced into medium lasers or whatnot, or, or large lasers or PPC. Um, all of which are not good. Like, I just love my ballistics and my missiles in this game. Not a huge fan of lasers. Oh, and the Centurion is also ready. <laughs> Holy hell, we got so many mechs this round. <laughs> Triple salvage. Triple salvage. Okay, um, a Centurion of Rapid Scrapping. 36k. Um, there's the Quick Draw. So we're at 700k, about 800k this round. Okay. And the Onion goes to the Reserve. What about the Banshee? Should I keep it or not? I mean, it's not a bad mech. But I feel the Battlemaster is better than the Banshee. I mean, the Banshee has a little bit more armor, yes. But... Battlemaster can carry an AC-20. Also, the Battlemaster is way too hot. <laughs> the Battlemaster runs insanely hot. Well, all my mechs run quite hot, to be honest. I'm not the best guy at building heat-efficient mechs. My my philosophy is if you can't kill it in, the, in two shots, it's not useful. Okay. Well, let's keep it like that, guys. And that's the end of today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed that. That was a surprising amount of heavy stuff on the field against us, but we managed to pull through. I'll see you in the next episode, wherever you are on this planet. Take care. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. TTB out. <laughs>